why Prince Philip prefers not to live with the Queen after 72 years of marriage. Prince Philip and Queen have spent the coronavirus pandemic self-isolating together, but ordinarily, they do not even live under the same roof. The Queen and Prince Philip have spent most of the time of coronavirus pandemic self-isolating together. They spent lockdown in Windsor Castle before flying to Balmoral and then moving to Sandringham in Norfolk. It's a big change for the royal couple who normally spend most of the year apart. While the Queen lives and works in Buckingham Palace, her husband prefers to stay in the countryside more than 100 miles away. Since he retired from public duties in 2017, the Duke of Edinburgh has lived at Wood Farm on the Sandringham Estate. He's actually only spent a handful of nights in London since he stepped down. Prince Philip, who will celebrate his 100th birthday next year, is said to enjoy living outside the spotlight, away from cameras and restrictions of royal life. At Wood Farm, he can enjoy his retirement and really relax. He reportedly spends his time reading, painting watercolors, entertaining friends, and enjoying the peace and tranquility. And wow, he doesn't live under the same roof as his wife, the Queen and Prince Philip do make time for each other. The couple, who have been married for 72 years, try to see each other as much as the Queen's busy schedule will allow. They are said to have really enjoyed the unexpected time together this year. The Queen will return to Windsor Castle in October and commute to Buckingham Palace for her official duties. Prince Philip will remain at his five-bedroom home in Norfolk. But staff are creating a special bubble between the two royal residences, so the couple can still visit each other in the months to come.